hi guys my name is Vineet so in this tutorial we will be writing a program of uh, string anagram so we, we will be having two string and uh, we need to check whether these two string are uh, anagram or not so let's get started with program A method name is is ana anagram and we are passing here two string two parameters one is string s1 and another one is string s2 so our first check will be we we have to check whether the s1 dot these both uh, string length should be equal then only we'll allow this uh, this string for the further execution and if uh, the length of this program is not equal and then we will be saying this is not a valid this is not an anagram and if length is uh, equal then we will uh, will do uh, uh, further execution of this these strings and let's convert if it is equal length so we'll be converting this uh, string into char array and the another one is we'll be using a string builder i'll explain you why uh, why we are using string builder here s2 so in string if you uh, if you check here in string we don't have any remove method rem or remove method and delete method we don't have these methods we have here replace uh, but we don't have any offset here I mean there are very uh, limited method inside string and string is immutable and string builder is mutable so string bu builder is very useful to uh, memory management so uh, if you check in string builder so we have here replace uh, and delete i guess yeah delete and delete from a particular character delete character uh, based on index we have so other methods as well that we can use in our program so that's why we are using this string builder So we will be iterating this string uh, sorry char array and we will say char ch char string and we will be asking a string builder to uh, give the index of particular character but if you see here this index of is expecting string so let's convert this character into string string dot uh, value of ch now we have here uh, index of that string that we extract from string builder and again uh, we are checking whether this uh, index is means that uh, character is present inside this string builder so it will return uh, index if this character will not present inside string builder in that case uh, it will return minus one so we are comparing whether uh, index is not equal to minus one means that character exists inside string builder if this index will mi will be minus one in that case we will saying uh, 
we will be saying that uh, character is not exist inside string builder and that case will be returning false here and in this case also so we are seeing here uh, if character is exist inside string builder so we are uh, uh, we are saying that string builder you have to delete that uh, character based on index so it will delete that character and so uh, so if all the character exist inside string builder so uh, this sb dot delete caret will be de uh, delete all the characters from string builder and yeah uh, at the last string builder bucket will be empty and will be returning true here and if any of a uh, character is not exist inside string builder so this uh, this uh, check this condition will not be executed and uh, this else will, will be executed uh, and it will return false so if this block will not be executed and in that case uh, we can say uh, this string is a uh, anagram so we have done with the logic let's check with the program input whether these uh, logic is working fine or not so south so this this method is returning true and false so i'm not keeping this value inside any variable i'm printing uh, that true and false directly so let's pass here java and vaja it's a valid anagram so let's test that it's true let's uh, pass it here so in this case length of both string is different it's not equal so in th this case it should uh, return false yeah it's not a valid anagram so let me pass a valid uh, I mean equal string length so in that that case this uh, validation check uh, will be uh, true here I mean this will not execute because length is equal and but this uh, this method should return false because uh, these both string are not anagram it's not equal so it will not be making anagram see it's false so let me give here a valid anagram uh, n i v t i v i n i t yeah it's valid anagram it should return here true yeah, it's true so this logic is working fine and we have done with this video guys uh, stay tuned for another videos thank you so much